Hi, Taurus. My Earth sign, Taurus. <clears throat> Thank y'all so much for coming to the channel and joining me for your reading tonight. This is for the uh, next 24 hours, okay? We already did a 48-hour one. So now we're going to move into the next 24 hours. <clears throat> don't forget to hit the big red subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the all notification bell so you won't miss out on any of the videos I upload. And you will always be notified. Don't forget, if you want, okay, everything in the description box. You can find it in the description box about my channel. Um, if you want to donate to my channel, okay, my cash app is in the description down below. If you want a personal reading, or if you want to know about my gifts, you know, anything you want to know, it's in the description box down below. I'm thinking about going on Instagram and doing like a Q&A, but not right now. Alright, but I will, I will do that for y'all. <clears throat> something going on with the itchy noses and the throat chakra with these um, tarot readers in, in, in 2021. Alright, in this Mercury retrograde. <clears throat> something going on, okay? Um, let's get into your spread. For my subscribers, gang, 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 thank you so very much for joining, coming back to the channel. I love y'all so much. <clears throat> Okay, who's trying to devise a plan of action for one? Okay, are you dealing with an uh, air sign, Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius? <clears throat> Is somebody trying to avoid you or you avoiding somebody? <clears throat> Excuse me. This message is going to get out, okay? It's, this message is going to get out. Who's, who's lying? Is this person lying? Cheating? Did they steal from you? Are they being manipulative? Who's doing this? Are you lying to yourself? Or is this person lying to themselves? Somebody lying to themselves. Somebody lying to you. <clears throat> Trying to be sneaky. Doing sneaky things behind your back. Because this person is non-committal. They are a free spirit. So commitment is not their style. Okay, but I see you um, trying to avoid something. Or avoid someone with the seven of swords. And you're trying to... Uh, <clears throat> Devise a plan of action or trying to escape a situation as to, um, you're trying to figure out a plan of how to, um, take a leap of faith here in another direction, okay? And I feel like you're going off into the wind and just doing it. You're not giving a care or a damn, okay? You could be dealing with a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. <clears throat> I feel like this leap of faith has, some, has something to do with your stability, okay? Your finances, I feel like it has something to do with your um, security. Okay, I do feel like for some of you, you are married. <clears throat> I do feel like there are boundaries around you or there needs to be. Okay. I feel like you are um, either married or a single man. So... I feel like someone is trying to devise a plan of action or trying to sneak away into a new beginning here, a new um, a new path, a leap of faith, maybe um, to go on an adventure. For some of you, I heard that um, there's a couple of people being sneaky. It may seem like they're being sneaky, but they're not. They're trying to um, get you to take a leap of faith because there's something going on at the company, okay? They have like... A surprise for you at, at, at your job or something like that. Alright, Taurus? For some of you, like a small portion of you. Not for everybody. But I feel like somebody was lying with the Seven of Swords. Lying to you about them juggling you and somebody else. Two of Pentacles. And now they have regrets over this, okay? Who is this? If this person is lying to themselves, they're going back and forth about the situation and they're feeling defeated. Alright, look, we're going to clarify everything because I'm not understanding. <laughs> Alright, but we will get to the bottom of it when we get into the reading, okay? And don't forget to subscribe, okay? Don't forget to subscribe, you guys. 
That helps me channel your energies. Why is the Page of Cups here? For Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Why is the Page of Cups here? Clarify the Page of Cups. Thank you. This could be somebody new that you're dealing with. Okay, Taurus. With the Page of Cups energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like um, you're getting intuitive messages. I feel like you're intuitive. Um, you may be curious about this person. This person may be, to you, um, e immature. But I do feel like someone wants to send you messages of love. Someone here. A new person. This could be someone that <clears throat> you already have a connection with. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Or this is someone who... Um, you on the same page with this person. You see eye to eye. Everything is good between you two. Okay. You're attracted to this person. They are attracted to you. You want the same things as they want. Right. I see you person I see you um communicating with this person online. Um, okay, Aquarius. And I feel like um this is fast, rapid, back and forth communication here. Okay. <clears throat> I do feel like something is happening quickly though, but I, I feel like this person may be younger than you or you're younger than this person or this fire sign, Aries Leo Sagittarius or this air sign. Okay, this like they all look young here. Three men here, they look young, okay? Who is this? This person coming in to offer you this cup, okay, it's not really much, but um, they do have emotions for you, and they do want to send you messages of love, and you're gonna, you're going to receive them, but I feel like this person is disloyal, okay, with the king of pentacles in reverse, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, or this person has earth prominent in their chart, this person is disloyal, dishonest, okay, this person is a liar, all right, so they're telling you, this person is telling you <clears throat> that they love you and they have feelings for you and they want to offer you uh, love, but they're, they're lying. They're being dishonest. They could be lying about being married, too. Because this, this king of pentacles is married, okay? And he paid. So it don't matter if it's his uh, husband or a wife here. She can have masculine energy too. Alright. And I see um, this is going to cause some type of karma. Yeah, because this is a karmic. This is someone that has come into your life to teach you a karmic lesson. Karmics, is, they're not meant to last forever. Like um, divine partners. Because it wasn't meant in that time for you to to be together in divine's time and it you you had to learn lessons first especially if you two meet and y'all broken already it's gonna be hard for the twin flames or karmics to get along because y'all two didn't heal before y'all got together and that's very very important why is the two of cups here clarify the two of cups for a quick what are you dealing with an Aquarius? Okay, look, Taurus. I don't know. Could be. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, okay? Because I was about to say Aquarius. And I know damn well this is a Taurus reading. All right? The Two of Cups. Yeah, this person. Look, the Two of Cups is clarified. The Two of Cups. Clarified by the Eight of Wands. Again, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy. You two are really communicating. <clears throat> Passionately online, okay, Taurus, and I feel like this is coming in hot and heavy, right? There's a lot of intimate messages coming through between both of you. You texting back, this person texts back fast, you know. Y'all on the same page, y'all in sync right now, okay, and y'all online just going back and forth. Right? This could be over any type of social media, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter, Messenger, Instagram, okay? TikTok, Kick, WhatsApp. Nah, let me stop. <laughs> but whatever, whatever social media, whatever. Okay? Y'all communicate a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. You could be dealing with the um, <clears throat> fire sign. 
Uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius. I see Virgo and Capricorn here, and I see Air and uh, Water. Ca uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, uh, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Why is the Eight of of Wands here? Clarify the Eight of Wands. Something significant may be happening around August, like the eighth month, okay? Just uh, keep your eye out for August. I don't know. Something's happening quickly there. Could be some type of travel, like fast travel. We'll see. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. This person wants to talk to you. With the two of cups, they want to see you face-to-face. -face. They want to talk to you. I don't care if this is FaceTime. Oh, wait, y'all been FaceTime and communicating online, but they want to talk to you. They do, um, <sighs> they're trying to get over, like, some regret, some, some regret they have from the past. They're trying to get over some sadness. They're trying to get over, um, some disappointment. Okay, I feel like they're not. They're not feeling this way anymore. They're not feeling disappointment, regrets. They're not feeling anything. Whatever y'all doing passionately online, this person is not regretting anything, okay? But I feel like, again, this person is very sneaky. This person doing some shit behind your back, okay? It could be at some, um, it could be like something at a distance from you, okay? This person could be, okay, I feel like there's a spouse here. Okay, someone, this person, um, y'all live together, have a living together situation, okay, um, you, you share resources, property, I feel like this person provides for you financially, or you do, but this person is at a crossroads, because they being sneaky, they trying to get away with some shit, and they going back and forth, and I feel like they have a decision to make, and they choosing their spouse, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Why is the Five of Cups here in reverse? Clarify the Five of Cups. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Well, someone is getting over regrets, disappointments, speaking their truth, okay? Air energy. Speaking their truth or standing in their truth, okay? They got the facts. They want the truth. Nothing but the truth for they giving you the truth. Nothing but the truth. So help you God. Okay. They coming in. They getting over these regrets. They telling you everything. Okay. They telling you everything. They feel like it may cause an ending between the two of you. Or this may have already happened within the next 24 hours. Okay. This person is stressed out and worried. Because um, they don't know if they, when they tell you this truth, if you're going to put things to an ending with them and they're stressing. Because they see you as the empress, okay? Some of you could be pregnant by this person, but I feel like they feel abundant with you. I feel like they look at you as very powerful, okay? Um, they see you as their queen, as their, you know, end-all, be-all. And I feel like they're going deep within to um, do some introspection or some shadow work or do some dark night of the soul healing because I feel like... You know, um, when they told you this truth right here, or whatever they said to you, um, I, I do think, I do feel this situation has transformed, and you um, put this to an end, and it really stressed you out, where you were suffering from sleepless nights, and worried about, um, you know, just having to detach from someone that you love, okay? Because you saw a lot of maturity coming in between the both of you. You saw you two growing in the relationship. You saw a lot of abundance in the relationship, okay? If your emperor was here, okay, I feel like you two would be a power couple here. This could be a Libra or a Pisces. But I do feel like, okay, there is a tower moment. Okay, something unexpected. This is either a sudden shakeup or like I said, it was an ending. So this could be a breakup, okay? Something has shocked someone here. Maybe um, when you told this person, for some of you that you're pregnant, it caught them off guard. They wasn't expecting it. But for some of you, um, 
they see you as the empress and you know they're, they're having a towel moment yeah this they're really heartbroken they're suffering from heartbreak and pain it could be a third party situation someone from their past okay maybe an ex a childhood friend or someone that they admire someone that um, they feel is very beautiful. I feel like they're asking you for forgiveness here, okay? Because I do see you walking away with the Eight of Cups energy. Or this person may have walked away from you for somebody from their past, okay? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy, okay? And I do see this person is spying on you, okay? Trying to figure out information, trying to look you up, trying to uh, spy on your social media, Okay? This person is being sneaky. They try to watch everything you do on social media so they could be sneaky, sneak around and juggle you and another person. Okay. And I do feel like they're in deep regret again. Feeling the loss, feeling the remorse this time. Okay. Because they've been waiting for someone. They've been waiting for you possibly. Or you, you've been waiting for this person. It's like you've been waiting and waiting and just waiting for this person. Right, and it's like you've been waiting for them to break your heart. Like, well, okay, what the fuck was I even waiting for? Like, what a third party situation? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right, Taurus, no, you're moving forward. Okay, you're getting the hell out of Dodge and you're moving. You could be relocating. Okay, leaving this person behind, moving forward. Next, yeah, and you're holding back from this person. Okay, you're restricting yourself from this person because you want to just cut cold. You know, give them the cold shoulder and be cold towards them and speak your truth. And I feel like this is what you're doing. You're bringing the truth raw, uncut to them, okay? And it's making them very confused. It's confusing them, okay? And I also feel like this person kept you as an option, okay? Because this person had many options, okay? And um, they had, um, they could have been dealing with an Aquarius. Someone who's in the spotlight. Someone who's doing something online is being seen, Right? I feel like they spying on that person too, okay? Because they want to take control of this situation. And I feel like this person is involved around the authorities, okay? They either all up in their head about the situation or your person is in jail, okay? But I feel like <clears throat> someone is going to be left hanging, right? Something is going to change with the Wheel of Fortune. Someone's looking fortune is going to change. And this one, this person is going to run, rush in, okay? Yeah, they feel like they're not done with you, okay? And um, they want to heal things with you because it confuses them that they can't manifest you back into their life. And they want to send you messages of love. This could be a younger Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, okay? They want to send you passionate messages, messages of love. But I feel like you're all up in your head about this, you know, trying to, you know, you're replaying these things over and over again in your mind, okay? Because I feel like you're in a mental prison of your thoughts. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, or someone is in jail, okay? Yeah, you sensed this. You knew something was going on. You knew something was going on. And it's going gonna, it's gonna to give this person their karma. It's going to change their life, change their luck and fortune. Because I feel like you had a whole family with this person, and they got the nerve to sit over here and give to two, balance things out with two. Oh no, it's done. You're done. You're done. You're done. And you're putting these burdens down. You're putting it into them burdens. And look, you're back in your empress energy. You don't give a fuck. You're not even bother. You have a lot of abundance power. You're beautiful. You are a nurturer. Okay? You put this person before you every single time to make things right between y'all. You love this person. But now I feel like your energy is guarded with the nine of wands. You're guarded. You don't even want this person around you, okay? Because they, you know, they betrayed you. They betrayed you and you were waiting for them and all of that. You know, some people that y'all dealing with is free. And some people that y'all dealing with is not. They in jail, okay? And I'm just letting you know that is the nine of swords meaning. A lot of tarot readers don't say it, but it do mean that someone is in mental prison or in prison, okay? So, I do appreciate y'all coming through, okay? I do love y'all. Thank y'all so much for coming, checking out y'all reading. This was very interesting, okay? I did feel the energy, um, Taurus, and I'm so sorry this person is putting you through that, okay? And if you ever need to book a personal reading from me, okay, my description, my, um, information is in the description box down below, 
if you want to donate to my channel, okay, and help my channel grow, okay, um, my cash app is in the description box down below as well. Don't forget to hit the big red subscribe button and don't forget to hit the all notification bell so you won't miss out on any of the videos I upload for y'all. Okay, so y'all need to stay tuned. And until next time, I love y'all. I love every single one of y'all, even my subscribers, gang, 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 gangs. I appreciate y'all so much. Until next time, bye Taurus.